gentlemen, we are in the middle of war. So let's see what we got going on here. 15 hours, 26 minutes left, and we're up 34, 24. Um, kind of what I just wanted to show you was <clears throat> the war stats. Um, so far, uh, most heroic attack comes via Magronigo. So let's just take a look and see what he did. So it looks like he's going to draw out Clan Castle Troop and draw it away. And that is textbook uh, for drawing out the Clan Castle. You want to draw them away and isolate them from the other defenses. So he did send his giants in way before the archers got close enough so the defenses wouldn't uh, destroy his archers. They'd focus on the giants. And I do know McGronigal loves the hogs. He always brings some in there. I think they're pretty darn good. And that is one thing I will say about McGronagall. He seems to always place the hill spells um, exactly where they need to go most of the time. Oh yeah, this this is over. He still has looks like one hog, a giant, and I can't even tell you how many archers he's got left. Yeah, it looks like almost all of them. Alright, well, so this is why he got most heroic attack. Um, he did attack up. He's 20, attack 19, and it looks like he three starred him. So I told our clan that I would post some of their videos from the war um, on ones that I thought that were deemed worthy. Um, this is one of them. So let's see what else. So what I'm going to do is later on, um, I'm going to go up here and show you some of our top guys and their attacks. Um, actually, it looks like they did pretty well. Uh, Teach got one star on their one. Uh, he got two on their number two. And Ranth got two on number three. So that's pretty good. So later on, when I'm done posting this, um, probably after the war, I will post some of these uh, higher accounts up here so you guys can see. Until then, uh, keep subscribing, uh, hit the likes, and I'll post more. Keep you updated.